here at the Cracker Barrel. Pancakes are golden, fluffy, oh, and now stuffed with creamy cheesecake. Enjoy a full pancake breakfast starting at $8.99. Cracker Barrel. Take care now. Hello everyone, this building here is an abandoned Cracker Barrel Old Country Store in Beaverton, Oregon. So let's check this place out, shall we? Here as you can see, that's where the sign used to show outside. It is available according to the sign. You'll have to call this number if you consider them buying this building. Yep, it's closed. You can pause the video to read the info. Here's the inside. Everything is gone so far. That's all I want. As far as you know, this restaurant opened in February 2018. And five years later, to March of this year, it has shut down for good. Not just this location, the restaurants in Tualatin and Ben were also affected. The reason why three places shut down is mainly because of COVID stuff. The earlier they closed down Cracker Barrel was at the Anson Beach Center in Portland. It was last year in August. That has nothing to do with pandemic issue. Um, it was related to safety concerns in that area. It's boarded up in the building college quay. I have that footage so make sure to check it out in the description below if you haven't seen. Anyway, this area right here used to be a gift shop. It's true that every Cracker Barrel had their own retail store combined with a restaurant, but I find it pretty cool and interesting. The dining area you were clearly been to your left center part. A checkout counter would have been towards the back of the left corner. You know that usually when Cracker Barrel closed a restaurant, they immediately bought out the windows and paint the exterior from brown and gray. There's a reason why it has to be like that. I'll tell you why. They have to paint it gray in order to protect the company's branding. I thought that's a pretty interesting fact. So now you know why it has to be like that. But for some odd reason, this one in the two locations in Tualatin and Bend aren't boarded up and no buildings are painted gray. Man, what are the odds? At first, I thought they were all going to be boarded up and stuff. Maybe there was an agreement between the landlords and the restaurant company to set those buildings like this. Or perhaps the company didn't want to bother paying plywood and hiring painters at all. It was probably expensive then, I guess. Those are my two theories so far. At least I should be grateful that I am taking a peek on the inside. And I've been wanting to know so freaking bad what the inside looks like after a Cracker Barrel closes down. All you see is an empty dining area. No more tables and chairs including the decorations, he empowers a lot of well. It's pretty sad to see it like that. Honestly, I wasn't expecting Cracker Barrel to close more locations. It came out of nowhere. And now we're on the other side of the building. Now the door will open. It would be so cool if I go inside to explore the former restaurant. I bet this place used to be so darn busy a while ago. This building is huge, so does the inside. I'm hoping that the former Cracker Barrel gets repurposed as soon as possible. It could be another restaurant or a retail according to the commercial real estate website. For the retail store, it looks like it would be the entire building. I wonder what if this place gets divided for more spaces. I'm not sure if the landlord will be okay with it. What if it ends up like that, really? I'm not sure otherwise. That's just a thought. This place seems to be in a good location, I believe. Now, we should be able to see the kitchen through the window. There you have it. The inside is brand new, even though it's only a few years old. The right side leads to the dining area, obviously. I can see that most kitchen equipment are gone, such as stoves and ovens. I don't know why. 
The only thing you can see are the things. So yeah. We're gonna be checking the rear building. We're here. The window is covered by a wall. There's a little door as well. I don't know what's that for. Here you got an office, it looks like. There's a pretty small looking one. You just basically see an empty shelf. This is such a rare find at the form of Cracker Bell. From what I understand, there's nothing many of them abandoned. And it looks like we got another office here. Never thought there would be visible windows to see the back building. The building setup looks very really nice. Another sign used to be up there. And that's pretty much it. That's you can wrap for real. Make sure you give a like, comment, share, radio and show. And until next time, peace out.